people, awesome people of the internet. This is Roblox Dude 101 here. Today I'm doing another Minecraft video. This time it's going to be on my uh, new fireproof house. I, it comes with an alarm system and a sprinkler system. So these are the sprinkler holders up here, and basically this redstone line lined up at the top of this house is the fire detector. So basically, if any of these blocks or any of these blocks get destroyed. It will set off a fire alarm. Unfortunately, this side or that side does not work. I don't know why. But yeah, so let's say this block gets destroyed. That's going to go off. See? So it's really cool. And then you can just put it back to stop it. So yeah, and these are the sprinkler holders. And I'm, the only thing, though, is the, only the fire alarm's automatic, not the sprinklers. But you know, that's better. Because that way, you don't have to... What's the point in flipping a lever to turn on a fire alarm? You need it to go off, you know? Alright, so let's say we're inside and just chillaxing, having fun. And let's say something catches on fire. Alright, so let's just say we're in our bedroom, just chillaxing. There's actually a sprinkler over here, over the bed. That sometimes when there's a, when there's a fire, it just automatically... See, look at that! The fire alarm, it went off! And that sprinkler automatically came on. I didn't know that would happen. But still, see, the fire alarm went off. That we have a fire. And that means that I need to get out of here as quickly as possible. And as you can see, the sprinklers do not help much, but they are still fun to use. So, now that I can hear the fire alarm going off, that tells me that there is a fire in the building and that I need to evacuate as quickly as possible. Good thing that fire alarm's there, because if it wasn't have been there, I could have been in there, and then it could have burnt me up to death, and I could have had all my diamond stuff on, you know? Could have killed me, and then I could have lost all of it in the fire. It would have been awful. Alrighty, so, that's basically it for this. So, as you can see, the fire alarm activated. Yes, it did activate. And if it ever gets destroyed like that, you can just... Let me show you after the fire gets out. You know, it doesn't really matter. Uh, the fire alarm tells you to get out of the house. That's more important than the house. It's you, you know? So, yeah, that's basically it for this. Uh, I'm going to turn this off. There we go. Alright, guys, so there you have it. There's your automatic fire alarm with sprinkler system. Although, you cannot turn on the sprinklers they're not automatic you have to flip a lever to do that let's see if that still works <laughs> well one did <laughs> that one didn't that was funny it, it just turned on as soon as that because sometimes that happens this sprinkler for some reason sometimes goes off automatically I don't know why but that's better you know alright so thank you guys for watching the video I hope you've enjoyed um, if you'd like a tutorial on how to do this well, you know what? I'm just going to do a tutorial after this video. So yeah, please subscribe and like for more videos. I have a link in the description to the video of the tutorial on how to actually create this. And I will see you guys in my next video. So just click the link in the description to go to that video and check it out. So goodbye, guys.